The like slap city style shield drop where you can press shield plus special, which is incredibly good. And the set is on its way. I was right. Link versus Ganondorf, a canonical matchup. Uh, I would imagine that this matchup could be a little bit rough for Ganondorf. Ganondorf being a float uh, heavy uh, that doesn't really have the best like anti projectile game uh, is sure it's gonna be really weird to deal with. However, um, uh, Miles Manners, former uh, supposedly sort of good at Project Plus, maybe the, maybe that matchup experience will carry over. Huh? Try going for the read. Different move in this game. Nice uh, edge cancel. I'm um, uh, uh, Dare coming out from Vinny Mac. Tech choice? Nope. And then Light Go Godin, raw. Hashtag revert Ganondorf Upstrong. Smash, my fault. Trying to get the back air to kill. Dare will just kill off the top, though. Not testing the shield drop in though. Getting hit with the shwiggy wiggy. Ooh, the good shield pressure. Uh, tried to get him to roll, but chain grab? Down B to follow attack. Oh yeah, it's just it's just up to him with the door. We're setting the neutral with the warlock kick. Zoning a little bit, lift that back in. Up smash in the center of the stage. Uh, and he misses the ledge, unfortunately. I know Miles goes by any slash roll, but I don't know if that's changed. Down to did not get punished by the up spot, but that was a little funky monkey. Nair, Nair, Y'all need to do some platform movement, please. Going to a Green Hill HDR smiley face. That that boomerang got fucked up. That. He stole his bomb. What's up, man? I hope that... You, you definitely know the game more than I do. I'm commentating because my guy Miles is on stream. Oh, shit. All right. Uh, uh, Vince is good. Vince is very good. Vince is good. Miles is a uh, former P-plus uh, player in TO. Okay, gotcha. Okay. Before they went on and uh, started dominating the realms of Aether scene. Gotcha, okay. So, well, there's a few things that carry over from Rivals of uh, Aether and HDR. The, uh, the wave dashing mechanics are basically just transport one to one yeah. over. 
Uh, but yeah, this I, does look like a rough matchup. <laughs> yeah, the matchup seems pretty bad, and also Ganondorf seems very different than P+, which, like, he has the basic, like, bones of P+, mm -hmm. Ganon, but he, uh, his, like, uh, smash attacks are different, mm -hmm. uh, which is something that's super important to Ganondorf, because uh, P+, Plus Ganon did a lot of 50-50 uh, stuff uh, through side B. Mm-hmm. Uh, and those like faster uh, smash attacks yeah. are really important to that. I do know that he does still have a 50-50 based off of his side B just oh, yeah. with his down smash, but uh, yeah, I'm less familiar with P+, so I'm not sure what all is being carried over from there. Uh, I will say special uh, float cancel. Ooh. Ooh! There we go. That's... That's the P-plus Ganon right there. That's pretty sick. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I love seeing all these heavies being better, but still. <laughs> Ooh. So tell me a little bit about uh, Vince and his, like, running. Uh, what I know about Vince is that every time he shows up, uh, somebody gets an upset. And it's usually Vince upsetting the higher seeds. And I believe that's why now they're just like, ah, put him at four. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I I looked at the ELO and uh, he was like uh, 20th, I think? Yeah. But to be fair, our HDR scene right now is very volatile. I think I remember uh, this talking about basically top three are basically guaranteed uh, yeah. we know which ones are that's, top three that's um benno uh shikari and um no shikari is not uh top three anymore not anymore no not anymore he hasn't been showing up to a lot though so. oh that makes yeah, sense yeah. Yeah. since he doesn't since rewind isn't a thing anymore